You take a taxi from the Zaragoza train slash bus slash plane station to the Botanic Hostel. The taxi driver says, as he drops you and your friend off in a narrow street, don't walk down that alley to the right, keep to the main roads. You appreciate his words of warning, but are caught off guard by his ominous candidness. The street is admittedly a little spooky, but the hostel inside, once you found the code that they emailed you eight hours ago, is actually quite nice. Pros. Reasonably near the city center and shopping district, each big room that contains six to twelve beds has its own bathroom with multiple stalls and showers. And maybe you won't like this, but I did. The beds are little bunk bed pods with their own privacy curtains. Cons. The hostel is more of a rest stop than a destination, so make sure you have stuff to do, because it's not really a place to hang out and meet people. The staff is often away or otherwise unavailable. And the biggest thing is when somebody gets out of bed, the lights for the whole room turn on, announcing it's 4 a.m. and I need to take a poo. Five out of ten.